Hi, welcome to Oakra Hamster. Today I got the unboxing of this Martian Victory Watch. And this was a Kickstarter project that I backed back in September. And it was supposed to be sent out earlier this year, January, but I didn't get it until just now, which is April. I paid about $110, but I also purchased a silver band, uh, wristband, which they have yet to mail to me. But in the meantime, the one I got, I believe, is this one, the silver and the uh, black band. So, well, let's just get this opened. So this is one of three models, the Victory. Well, there's also the Passport model, and then there's also uh, some other model. And for some odd reason, my model, even though they said that all the models are identical internal components, this one was shipped last. So they said they had issues with this one, which I just don't see why. How can they possibly have issues? Because there was also like the G2G watch, and then there's the passport models. Those all shipped. All right, it's a nice square. A quick connect guide, an overview. Basically, what this watch does is, if, if any of you were old enough, uh, back in the day, there used to be like this Dick Tracy comic book that I, I just loved. And what this does is, this watch is built in Bluetooth, so I can essentially use, <laughs> put this watch on my wrist and just use it as a Bluetooth speakerphone. Uh, because, uh, well, it's just, I don't know, it, it just sounds really cool to me. And, oop, something just dropped out. This is a micro USB charging cable. And another thing that, that attracted me to this was that it also issues voice commands to the cell phone. I don't. I think there's something about scrolling the text messages on the bottom, but that one I wasn't too thrilled about because the the uh, display screen down here was just too small. Well, it works for was that iPhone, iPad, iPod, Android phones, and even made for iPhone five. It even says iPhone five on here. Excellent. So let's see what else it comes with. So we sell a USB charging cable, a foldable travel AC USB adapter, and it's international. It's so it's input 100 to 240 volts, outputs at 5 volt at 1 amp, which is good because at 1 amp, essentially, I think you can use as a charge your iPhones too. All right, let me see what else, anything else in this quick start guide. Getting started, turn on your watch, pairing button, setting the time. Oh, I'm just too eager, so let me just uh, open this up. I haven't owned a watch in, wow, probably a decade or so. It is thick. You definitely feel the weight. It's like a rubber type of uh, band, wristband. The watch is not waterproof. Uh, they mentioned that early on. It would be nice if it was, but the mission is not waterproof. They call it water resistant, but essentially it just means that you can't take it for a swim. Let's see. On the back, it says Martian and 24, 39, 35. That's essentially how many hours in a Martian day. And this is the on a, also engraved on the bottom here, Kickstarter Limited Edition. The, the problem about the engraving is that this back piece is plastic. Oh, I mean, the front looks great, but this is just not what I expected. I can't remember the last time I owned a watch. Even when I was a child, I had a plastic back piece. Hmm. Alright, uh, let me see if I can turn this on. Press these two buttons here. Oh, alright. Okay, that's Bluetooth key code. So here's my iPhone 5. Let me turn on the Bluetooth. Martian watch. 
Bam. Let me see. Pair. Hmm. All right. So it's pair with Meat Phone Five. See, app not installed. The accessory voice command watch uses an app you do not have installed. Would you like to get this app from the App Store? All right. All right. So the Martian Watch app. That one, I'm still having problems installing from the App Store. But let's take a look, closer look at the watch itself. So starting from the right side, right here, this is the time dial. Where you, if you just pull it out, you can basically adjust the clock. Like a traditional watch. And just push back into lock so that you don't accidentally change the time. And right below that, right this one right here, you just flip this cover out. And this is where you plug in the micro... USB for charging and this piece right here, this little grill, this is the microphone. Down here, here's the speakers. This one is basically to enter the menu and the top one right here invokes Siri. So if I press this once, what time is it? 39 p.m. Uh, awesome. Now, when I was browsing through the menus here, basically, uh, if you just press it once, it tells you the battery life, the volume, and Bluetooth. So I just keep pressing it. I can adjust the volume. I can even enter camera mode, which is interesting. Let's see. If I let's say camera, would like to communicate with the Martian watch voice. Let's try allow. So, so I'm going to take some pictures by just pressing the button here. All right. This is awesome. It's like remote access for the camera. This is, I am very excited about this. It's basically, the camera itself, you need to buy like a third-party app or something to add a, a timer feature. But now I can just basically mount the camera somewhere and just press this. Snap. All right, enough of that. Let me see what else. Volume, camera mode, LED. Let me turn on, off. Find phone. This one, I'll need the Martian app to to, for, to get that one to work. What is this? Leash? I'm not sure what a leash is, but I'll turn it on. Gesture? Yeah, sure. Setup. Let's browse the setup. I can choose a language English, Espanol, French, Deutsch, Chinese, Korean, Japanese. I'll uh, keep it as English. Mm, date time. I mean, month date. A to DP. Alright, sure. That means so. Oh, that means I can play my music. The rest of here is update. There's test mode and exit. And exit. So this was that micro USB cable. While we're waiting for it to download, just plug it in here. Okay. Fits perfectly. Since it's micro USB, I can essentially take the the cable from my uh, Sony RX100 and use it with this, the uh, Victory Watch too. All right, so this time the Martian Watch Alerts app downloaded it. See, watch is not connected. Let me connect this. Watch is connected. So was that enable LED? Sure. Set vibration sensitivity sense intensity. Let's move to the other apps. Another piece of this app, alerts, direct message for Facebook, sure. Twitter mentions, event alerts, I'd like to access my calendar, nah, forget it. I can also set the do not disturb from certain time to certain time. This is cool. Let's see, configure sync. Selected frequency and minutes. As I set the frequency and minutes, Martian Watch Alerts will set notifications Will send notifications to the watch 
no higher fre frequency will deplete the phone's battery life. All right, so let's leave it as the default. For display, world clock, I'll leave it as off. I choose a time zone. Let's choose uh, New York. Forecast, no, I don't care about the weather. I can choose my language, LED. <clears throat> so basically, this everything I see in here, the setup, it was similar to what I saw on this one right here. Except I don't see the A2DP here. There's also that little, I think that's a accessory symbol on top right there. To the right of the Bluetooth. I've never seen that symbol before. Alright, so uh, everything on paper looks good. Everything that I play around with looks really cool. But the important thing is call quality. The microphone and the speaker. So what I'm going to do is call my own cell phone. And uh, let's just see how it goes. But since the phones are so close to each other, expect some feedback. Okay, so I'm just going to press this phone here. The car ID shows up as my wife. Hello there. The speaker is pretty clear. I'm going to hold the speaker from this closer to the camera. And it's, and it's it's one of the, one of the a lot better lot quality better speaker quality than I've ever heard, heard before. before. For such a small With size, I would have thought that this was a speaker from an actual cell phone or something. Or something. <laughs> okay. And as for the audio quality on uh, with this microphone, I'm just going to hold this earpiece closer to the camcorder mic and just talk into the. The uh, Martian Victory Watch. Hello, testing one, two, three. How does that sound? Not bad, actually. Okay. I just hung up. Call ended. Oh, man. I'm really impressed with this. I know I, it looks very bulky. It's got that cheap plastic on the back side, which is. I think out of everything, my biggest disappointment is the plastic. This cheap plastic is just the boggles the mind. Everything else looks like top grade, except when you turn it over, even the engraving. I, I thought it was going to be actual engraving, like on stainless steel or something. Hmm. All right. Now that let's put on a watch. See how it feels. Check out the weight. So for me, I don't normally wear watches. The last time I wore a watch was probably uh, 10 years ago, maybe. I can't remember the last time. Oh, maybe 15 years ago. I can't remember the last time I actually had a watch. Okay. I'll be driving. So even at arm's distance, the microphone and the speaker quality is pretty good. And another reason why I bought this is because on my car, it doesn't have built-in built in like a, a Bluetooth or hands-free set. So, to me, this is well worth it. For $110? Man, this, I'm really excited about this watch. So, but as for the battery life. The battery life, they said it's about 2 hours talk time. And about 7 hours, uh, well, not 7 hours, 7 days of standby time. And the timepiece itself will run for about 30 days on a charge. Oh, my wife's calling. Oh, is he crying? No, I'm making a video right now. You what? I'm making a video. Oh, can you do it quick? Sure. Okay. Okay. Alright. Well, he'll just be in my video then. Okay. Okay, I'll call you back. Bye. Bye bye. So, right on camera, my son now wants to, uh, what do you call it? FaceTime. Where did I install FaceTime? Hello? Yeah. Hi. Yeah. 
Okay, okay so even on FaceTime, the speaker, the all the sounds coming from this. Hmm. Bye 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 I highly recommend everyone out there. I used to look into one of these, these smart watches, um, this Martian Victory watch. I'm very impressed with it. I would highly recommend it. The, the quality from this, the core quality, a lot better than I expected. All right, so stay tuned. I'll see if I can have, have, have time to unbox the, the Pebble watch next and perhaps do a little comparison. I know the Pebble watch doesn't have uh, audio for microphone and speaker, but has other types of uh, neat functions. Okay, so thanks for watching Walker Hamster. If you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to send to me. Bye.